this is a relationship that continues to grow and mature on the strength of the relationship between yourself and President Trump. The decisions do not signal a change of policy or determination of responsibility for the attacks on U.S. government personnel in Cuba. Investigations into those attacks are still ongoing. Regarding the attacks, there are now 22 people who have been medically confirmed to have experienced health effects due to the attacks on diplomatic personnel in Havana. The Cuban government has told us that it will continue the investigation into the attacks, and we will continue to cooperate with them in this effort. We will also continue our own investigation into the attacks. We have concerns about the future of Pakistan's government, too, in terms of them. We want their government to be stable. We want it to be peaceful. And many of the same issues they're struggling with inside of Pakistan are our issues. So we think there is opportunity for us to strengthen that relationship. We're going to be working very hard at all levels, from the uh, State Department to the Defense Department to our intelligence communities, as well as economic.